Hey guys, PC Outcast here, back with another episode of Kingdoms of Amalur after that incredibly annoying fight last time. So let's go talk to he. Uh, Hello that again. Way? Is she trying to? Hello's end is where I belong. There's much to do to rebuild the village and repair morale. Well, I'm just the woman to do it. Okay. I don't know why you were following me around to tell me that, but fair enough. Oh, you're just following me, I see. I saw you coming. The cards spoke to me like they have not in ages. You are the one I was marooned here to find. My path has been made for me. You see, there are few in this world who can truly plot its course. Many try, but all of them fail. Great figures always rise up. Sometimes the gods create them, and sometimes they create the gods. But true heroes are born. Or in your case, reborn. You are the scion now, and you carry with you the blessing of Akara. There is no one on this earth more worthy of being called a god than you. And so I will go to prepare the way for when you come. The world changes, and the people must be ready. Crazy. Buccaneer, by slaying the notorious pirate king Dead Kel, you have proven yourself cunning and resourceful. The master punter, hunter? Master pirate hunter of the vast and treacherous Frostbreak Sea. Plus 3% chance to critical hit. Plus 5% physical resistance, minus 10% equip requirements. Okay. And we can uh, change things again. Your destiny if your... we wanted to, but we don't want to right now. So we're done with that. My goodness gracious. Okay. Um, we can return to Patty as well. And there's a couple of quests over here. Come on. Get me over to Grave Hall. Let's go check it out. I need to get back and get rid of this damn cursed amulet. Or at least get rid of the curse, if not the amulet itself. The tunnels have been cleared, my liege. You are free to roam Gallows End to your heart's contentment. As far as exploring the island goes, I would recommend bringing on Zephwin Lan from Cape Solace as your scout. Okay. What should we do? Where, sorry, what should we restore next? I think you'll like what I have planned next. A vast library. Just imagine a monument to the wisdom of the ages standing there beside the main structure, beckoning the unenlightened. But first, I'll need you to get me three bundles of bear hide, three bundles of ember wood, and four bundles of sailcloth. Okay. I suppose it was in your books? Yes. One of them mentions a library. At first, I was confused. I found many books, but not enough to warrant a whole building. But my dream again provided the answer. What exactly was in your dream? This part of the dream didn't make sense until now. I saw stacks of books, heard strange voices in tongues unknown to me. I believe this library was to be a center for translating arcane and lost languages. Okay, what library? It's going to be a tribute to knowledge, one that will drive a Odessa to envy. Okay, I will get what you need. Zephwin has provided me with possible locations of the materials. I'll be ready to start as soon as you get back. Sounds great. Bye. And where's this Zephwin? Good to see you. 
Yes, my liege. Okay. Be wary. And actually have any kind of uh, any kind of conversation with you. Great. Uh, it's up there. Okay, whatever. Let's go to Cape Solace. See if we can get the hell off this island and deal with that amulet first. Then we can come back and finish cleaning up Deuce. stuff here. And yeah, there, there's other quests and stuff. That's fine. Let's yeah, we can talk to her. Let's do a save. Just in case something goes horrifically wrong. And Radigan. You had me worried. Honestly, why do you act like that? Throwing yourself headlong into dangerous situations. No more. Do you hear me? If you and I are going to woo and woo with vigor, you're going to be more considerate of my needs. And there are many. <laughs> like sex. I, I mean sex. To show that you're my consort, you should take this. It's a sword. It was my mother's. She was a terrible person. Oh. Okay. Don't go far. Um. But. How do I get off of this goddamn island? Can I just. Can I just teleport? Can I just. Seriously. Let's find the quest that we need to do. Uh, cleanse the amulet. There you go. Can I can I just go and do this? Oops. You cannot travel off of. What is going on with this place? I can't leave. I still oh wait. There's somebody to talk to. Right. <laughs> so sweet. Here. Are they down there? Oh, uh, there's the howling still. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Who am I supposed to be talking to? <sighs> I can't get off this freaking island. Fine. What do you need? Oh, you've come at last. I've been praying for your return. Cape Solace is under attack. What? Ships have landed. Prisoners have been taken. We have no one left to protect us. What? Who? Your daughter Nina and a few others. She must have been poking her nose where it didn't belong, creeping through the crevices of the northern cliffs. She was literally here like two seconds ago. To venture too far from the village. That girl. When will she open her eyes? What do the invaders want? They want the power beneath this island. Akara's magic which many over the centuries have coveted and sought to possess. Understand, Gallows End has long been a prize for the corrupt and the curious. The Arathi, the Alfar, the Tverga, and even Dead Kel. Invaders come brandishing their weapons, but always they are swept back out to sea. They are not welcome here. Okay. Um, blame Akara. You would like that, wouldn't you? But this isn't Akara's doing. This is ours. We depended on another. We grew soft and helpless. I have no one but myself to blame. Right. Uh, tell me about the invaders. They are led by a local far nobleman named Calder Von, a scholar and mage who has studied this island intensely and who wishes to have it for himself. He brings with him the righteous flames of the Niskaru, demons he has harnessed for this purpose, and this purpose alone. <sighs> no one invades my island. I mean, I'm... I'm the king of Grave Hall. You will fight, but you will die. These invaders will roll across this island like a wave, and not even you can stop them. Perhaps our time at Cape Solace has come to an end. Like Akara, it cannot protect us anymore. The invaders make their camp in the north along the cliffs. If any prisoners live, they will be there. I pray you're not too late. Where are they again? It's that they are being kept in the landing party's camp in the cliffs to the north. You must move quickly. Be careful. I guess this is another reason why I can't leave. It's me. 
I killed the scion and dumped her body into the sea. That is the truth of it. And it did not bring me peace. I was wrong. Only now do I see it, now that the deed is done. You were right. I'm not a killer. And if I ever had a second chance, I've long since squandered it. I don't even deserve a last request. What is your last request? I told you about my mother. How she died in the icy waters of the Frostbreak Sea. A victim of this village's treachery. For my last wish, I want to hold her ring again. We carried nothing when they banished us. Not even a skin of water. A blanket to shield us from the sun. I want my dead mother's ring. I wish to be wearing it when they make me walk the gallows. Mm, what will they do to you? I've killed the old scion, and I must face punishment. They will force me to walk the gallows and plunge into the roaring waters below. I am not afraid. The rocks will kill me long before I have a chance to drown. Okay. But, uh, yeah, sure, whatever. If I can get the heck off this bloody place. Thank Mitharu. You do not know what this means to me. You'll find the ring beneath a large stone in the tidal pools, where my mother spent her days praying for escape. Anything else you find is yours to keep. Now hurry, before the villagers choose to shorten my sentence. And uh, where exactly is the ring? My mother kept a camp in the tidal pools beneath the cliffs. Oh, of course it wouldn't be the away from the, the island, would it? There is a large stone. Beneath it lies my mother's worldly possessions. The few she had. Okay. I'll be here. Sure. Oh. this place it's right right here oh okay New location. Nice, okay. Well, whatever. Well, doesn't look like we're getting rid of that thing just yet, boys. I forgot about that. Uh, yeah, I don't think I'm gonna make it. Oh. Don't, don't do it. Oh boy. Yeah. No health potions equals insta death. Yeah. Hope it saved uh, since my last actual hard save. Okay, I definitely... Do I really not have any health potions? Like, I burned all my health potions on that dead Cal fight. And I can't even make any more. Okay, we're gonna have to be a lot more careful. I don't have any reckoning mode to deal with this. Yeah.
Okay, that wasn't quite as bad as I thought it was going to be. the heck that is I don't think I actually want to get that and and what I'm gonna do is save more often <laughs> I guess we have no healing Is that noise. <sighs> okay. Yeah, I'm gonna have to make an absolute ton of health potions. Um, sure, that's probably worth something if I can ever sell anything again. It's gonna be bad. <laughs> Missed. Missed. You go down, you stand down. Oh. Healing potion. Uh, is that? How do I um? After radio. There you go. Okay, we got a healing potion now. Come on, jump. Goodness. The jumping is real in this place. And there's a. I think I'm gonna just check at, at pretty much every chest I can. Just bugs? No thanks. Just in case um, there's some healing potions in them. Got something here. And no. Uh, I guess we're supposed to go this way. Check out the loot. Ah! Crap, crap, crap. Oh, crap. C can you please move? Ah, God damn it. Nope. 
All that for nothing. Oh, crap. Uh, yeah, okay. Save on the tidal pools. Okay, this couldn't possibly go badly, right? Couldn't possibly go badly. Slow down. Level, level, nice. Okay, um, so we've maxed out Sagecraft and um, Detect Hidden. I mean, we can continue to improve lockpicking, I guess. Mm, no. Dispelling? You can fail at a, at dis, to dispel a ward once before it explodes. You can fail twice before it explodes. Hmm. Interesting. Um. Yeah, I'm really not that impressed with what we find in chests, to be honest. Maybe some of these, di dispelling some of these things would be a good idea. But I think we're going to have to respec that. I think we'll have to, like, remove what we have in mercantile and lockpicking and dump it all into dispelling. Or we can do more alchemy. I mean, those health potions, even the minor ones, are still pretty good. Okay, let's, let's try that one. Sorcery. Where are we at? So we got Meteor now. Oh, we can do uh, that. Yeah, max, max that one out. And we're not quite there yet with that. Okay. Look, I'm, I have like a reduced amount of um, magic now. What's going on with that? Oh, is that my shield? Oh, might be that. Yeah, it might actually be my shield. Like junk. And of course, there's enemies here. Slow down though. Ish. Uh, Akara's heart. Interesting. Can I? Can I? I can't fast travel out of here. Oh, I can go that way. I can sort of fast travel. 
Ooh, that's uh, some artifacts there. Don't look at that. Funny, I haven't actually seen artifact, uh, graphical artifacting in games for, for a while. They used to happen all the time. Kill Tari myself. Okay, bro, I got your mom's magic ring. You found it. I knew you would. Now listen to me. Hear my confession. What I did was wrong. I have found peace with my fate. They will execute me when the time is right, and I will not protest. But I want you to remember. But I was more than my misjudgments. I was a good son, a good sailor. I was only human. Don't you want to live? Now that I've fulfilled my mission, what else is there? Gallows End raised me, and the island will see me to sleep. Once, a long time ago, I wanted to live. But the moment I swore to avenge my mother, I surrendered what little hope I had left. All right, your life for hers? Your life for hers? Anything I can do? No, I had my chance to choose and I chose poorly. I must live out my sentence, however long that may be. Thanks again for your concern and wisdom. In the end, the road we travel, we travel alone. Farewell. Farewell. Okay, farewell. Oh, and a fade to black. Oh, we're actually gonna witness the... Uh, oh. Mm, I guess they just kind of chucked him off there. Oh. Didn't, isn't this the same place I jumped off and I lived? Hmm. Right, okay, that was a little strange. So that's done. Can we, can, any chance we know it's still, the bridge is still raised. So what do we, what do we need to do to get out of here? Nice to see you. And who is the person I'm supposed to talk to over here? I thought it was Bradigan, but it's they're like right here. I don't like. There's nobody down there. I'm glad you're settling in. It'll take me a while, I'm afraid. Too many strange occurrences on this island. Um, oh, you can do some repairs. Nice. That's great. Thank you very much. Be safe out there. Bradigan, can I've can you please you get me off this island? All right? I want to sail. That I can do. Oh, fantastic. Okay, hang on. Really? Yeah, 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 yeah. Not just not just not let me know. save. Just let me save. I can't save. <sighs> Thank you. There you go. Save. There. Maybe. Maybe possibly. Will this please work? Did you expect all of that business about the giant that I can do? Oh. Oh. Finally. Finally. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Let's get that quest. And um, uh, that one. Okay, go to there. <sighs> Maybe we can actually get this thing done. <laughs> Okay, there's that, and then there's... it's up here somewhere.
Hey, there's a uh, free XP. Oh no. bears should have just left me alone all right let's grab this look to these open plains nestled where mire and rocky deserts cease where the hungry forests end in the bosom of the feylands these fields are home to the languid sky this work shaped by the delicate artistry of an inspired painter is for all the peoples of all lands Okay, this is not going to be super duper easy, is it? We're going to have to run all the way around, killing a bunch of things as we go. So let's uh, make that a separate, separate save. Agonizing. <sighs> oh, this curse is absolutely terrible. Gauntlets of wizardry? Yeah, I should have I should have sold stuff. <sighs> of course. Now nah, whatever. Okay, that one's dead. Agonizing slowness. Oh, it's so brutal. <sighs> oh, I can't wait until this is done. Ne yeah, I have room. I have room for healing potions. Thank you very much. Uh, uh, what about, uh, use that. Medallion of lightning attenuation? No. Greaves of lightning warding? No. Go this way and avoid all those enemies. That would be nice. Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh my God! <laughs> Come on, game work for me here. Oh, don't make me fight all these. Finish this one off, please. Thank you. Ugh, die. All of you just 
die quickly. Ah, running through molasses. Oh no, look at them all. No, 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 no. No good. And you know what? Here you go, guys. Why does that that uh, attack not never it just never works? It doesn't do anything. They always always interrupt you. Always. Every time you cannot actually use that. Oh, I'm I'm just gonna I'm gonna stand here and die. Um, you literally can't. Oh my god! You literally can't use that spell at all. Oh, it is so slow. Holy crap, with the stagger locking and everything. <sighs> oh. oh man, the combat better get better after I've gotten rid of this freakishly horrible curse. So if it doesn't, Oh, this thing's gonna be fun. Come on. Finish it. Lu... Lun Lunala's cap? Oh, come on. Just whatever. Just throw... In practically anything away. Look, just throw all of those out. Fine. Yes. So many... So many... Things you gotta go through. To get rid of one thing. Oh, it's finesse anyway. <sighs> of course it is. Okay. Cleanse. Be cleansed. When you place the eye of Amon onto the altar, its glow brightens and then goes out. Okay. Can I get out of here? Oh, it's an open for me. Nice. Thank you very much. Oh, that's... Kind of terrifying. Okay. And... Return... Amulet there. Are there two Lovely day, circles highlighted? What what what's going on with this? Return it now that it's been cleansed. I should return it to one of the two men who desire it. Edwin waits along the road where I left him, while the true owner Wayne lives in Amir or whatever. I might as well just return it to uh, to Wayne. I don't know which is which, and they're right next to each other, so that's good. You and you. What do you want? I'm in the midst of a personal crisis, and I wish not to be disturbed. Damn freemen. Okay, you're a jerk. Hmm. This village was once a bustling crossroads for traders and dealers in the arcane. However, in recent years, it has become a barren outpost for the ignorant. Uh. Tell me about yourself. I am W. E. Mundus, owner of Oddities and Curios by W. E. Mundus. I have lived in the Mare Village for nearly one year. I detest it. And don't get me started on the Alpha. Okay, you suck. Goodbye. 
So, you. Don't mind me. Just another refugee looking for a handout. Life's tough, what with the Freeman striking us at every turn. You understand, I'm sure. Still, blood is still gush gushing out of his, his arteries here. He really should get that looked at. I have the amulet. Wonderful. Give it here. The amulet itself isn't worth the stone it's made from. But it's the story that interests me. Something of Armand's belongs to me. All right. Good luck. You do not have enough space. Oh. That's why I like you. You prefer action to debate. You will go far because of it. Like me. Well, like me before I was betrayed and left for dead. Right. Hi. Hang on a second. Let me try to get rid of some stuff. Uh, boots of intensity. There you go. Get rid of that. Wait. You and I should strike up a partnership. Just give, if I survive. Are you? Did you just? Did you literally just rob me? You're not gonna give me the thing now. Oh. Well, doesn't that just sum up that entire quest? Thanks for joining me, guys. We'll see you in the next episode.